I got these plastic baseballs from the Dollar Tree. They came three in a pack for a dollar. And using some General Finishes gel stain, I applied the gel stain over the entire ball. You want to make sure you wear gloves and you have some paper towels. And I applied it using the foam brush. It was much easier. And I did this to 10 baseballs. And I just didn't want them to be pure white. Then I took a small art brush and some Republic Red Wise Owl paint. And I just lightly brushed over the raised stitching on the plastic. And you don't want a lot of paint on your brush while you're doing this. And then I just put all the baseballs to the side. I then took this wreath frame that you can also grab at the Dollar Tree. And I had this piece of burlap and I just traced the wreath frame and cut it out. Now you can use any material, I just had the burlap on hand. And then I laid that on the inside of the frame. And using some floral wire, I just went around the frame and attached the burlap to the frame. And I did this because I needed some kind of barrier on the inside of the frame here. Now I have seen the wood wreath rings that you can use in place of this wreath form as well. And once I had it attached, I just went around and cut off any extra material that was hanging off the edges. Then I had some Spanish moss, and you can find this at the Dollar Tree as well, or I grabbed this big bag from Walmart. And I took my hot glue gun, and I attached the Spanish moss around the wreath. And this is why I use the burlap on the inside here, so I had something to attach the Spanish moss to. And I believe this is a 10 inch wreath frame. And once I had the Spanish moss attached, I just went around and cut off any loose pieces. And using some E6000 and my hot glue gun, I attached the baseballs to the entire wreath. I then took more floral wire and I just went in between some of the baseballs to secure the burlap down. And then I took a chunky piece of ribbon and attached it to the top of the frame. And then I took different sized ribbon to make my stacked bow. And you're going to go from biggest to smallest. And then we secured that using some floral wire as well. And now we just have this Americana style baseball wreath and if you have a favorite baseball team i think picking the team colors for the ribbon is also a great idea guys thank you so much for watching paint products can be found on our webpage at chalkitupfancy.com and you can check out some other tutorials over on our youtube